In spring 2004, the late country star Naomi Judd's former Tennessee mansion was listed for rent at $15,000 per month. Naomi's sprawling estate sits in the upscale rural community of Leapers Fork near Nashville and boasts nearly 8,000 square feet of space and four bedrooms inside. The home was first listed for rent in September 2023, 18 months after her tragic passing in an upstairs bedroom. Naomi Judd was a country music star, while her two daughters, singer Winona Judd and actress Ashley Judd, would also go on to be successful in the entertainment industry. After giving birth to her first daughter, Winona, at just 18, Naomi and her daughter would eventually attempt to conquer country music as a mother-daughter duo. But in the early years, long before they became famous, Naomi was raising her two daughters in a one-bedroom apartment, surviving on food stamps, and working as a cocktail waitress. Everything changed in 1983 when Naomi and Winona as the Judds skyrocketed to fame with their hit single, Had a Dream for the Heart. But just eight years into their success, Naomi received devastating news. She was diagnosed with hepatitis C, a life-threatening illness. At the time, doctors gave her only three years to live, forcing the Judds to end their career together. Their farewell concert became the most successful musical event in cable pay-per-view history. After that chapter, Naomi retired to her sprawling 1,000-acre estate in rural Tennessee, which is now up for rent. Sadly, Naomi would be found in her sprawling Tennessee farmhouse after taking her own life. This was the same place where she's lived since the late 80s and where her daughters each had their own individual homes on the property. This thousand acre estate was also known as Peaceful Valley. Naomi was open about her struggle with mental illness before her passing on April 30th, 2022. She was suffering from bipolar disorder when she tragically took her own life and her family also revealed that she was battling post-traumatic stress disorder. While Naomi and her family had previously spoken in general about her long struggle with depression, the medical examiner's report from Nashville, along with a family statement, provided the most detailed account of the mental health challenges that she faced before her passing. The 76-year-old singer reportedly had a significant history of anxiety, depression, and bipolar disorder. Naomi had previously considered ending her life, and she was dealing with recent life stressors on her final days. Prior to this tragedy, Naomi was able to find some peace on her family farm for many years. The estate, with features like its magical on-site lake, became a sanctuary for Naomi and her family. Living in such a small, tight-knit community also allowed the Judds to enjoy their privacy without being bothered when out and about. This luxurious country estate where Naomi Judd lived at the time of her passing went up for rent in spring 2024 for 15K per month. And the property is no doubt fit for a country music royalty. Nestled in the secluded village of Leapers Fork, Tennessee, an area outside of Nashville with a population of just over 600, the Judd family's estate was a grand property full of nature's beauty. Naomi wasn't the only one who lived on the estate. Both of her daughters actually had their own homes just a short walk from their mother's front door. Naomi's four bedroom, six bathroom home, spanning 7,774 square feet, was first listed for rent in September 2023, 18 months after her tragic passing. This elegant property is fully fenced and gated, providing total privacy in a serene environment. A welcoming porch extends along part of the front exterior while a grand port coche on one side offers a convenient space for guests and their cars to arrive. The home's high ceilings and numerous windows allow plenty of natural light to fill the interior. Inside the home boasts a grand two-story foyer with a sweeping staircase and the master suite is impressive as can be. Additional features include intricately carved ceilings, fireplaces, an expansive entertainment area complete with a separate bar and ice maker. The back of the home is just as charming as the front, featuring a spacious screened porch, ideal for relaxing and soaking in the surroundings. The estate has undergone extensive renovations since Judd's passing. Now, Naomi showed off her home base in 2016 when she gave Oprah a tour. She proudly presented her large family room, which was more like a movie theater. 
And of course, no country estate would be complete without a stunning kitchen, what was apparently Naomi's favorite room in the house. The kitchen featured a round table and chairs set apart from the island, making it perfect for family meals, even if Naomi's daughters never quite agreed on what to eat. The bright all-white kitchen also offered sleek stainless steel appliances. Several fireplaces added warmth to the expansive rooms in the house, including the massive entertaining space, which is large enough to serve as a ballroom or small wedding venue. Naomi Judd's husband, Larry Strickland, revealed in late 2023 that he sold the estate following her death and relocated to Florida, where he now lives by the beach. Judd's daughters, Winona and Ashley, previously lived on those neighboring properties, but Ashley, while well, she has since moved out and her home is also currently available for rent. While Naomi Judd's former Tennessee estate may have a bit of a sad history, let's not forget that for many years it served as a retreat and sanctuary for the country music legend. It was here, surrounded by the beauty of nature, that Naomi found some peace and spent her years after a remarkable career. Even so, Naomi privately battled with mental health struggles and her tragic passing has shown the importance of addressing mental health even for those who seem to have it all. And I think we'll end today's house tour there. Thanks for watching. I'm Kara, follow me on Instagram to chat, and I'll see you all in another video.